James Lockwood. I work for JISC in the UK Data Service. My role is as the Research Impact and Engagement Manager. We're in the Science and Industry Museum in Manchester and we are having the first meetup of the 2023 Research Impact Fellows. My name is Natasha Chilman. I am a PhD researcher at King's College London. My name is Nilufar Shwari. Uh, I am an Early Career Research Fellow at Imperial College London. My name is Tassos Papastiliano. I'm from the Institute of Public Health and Wellbeing from the University of Essex. I think it's really important to, to shout about the research that we do using data from the UK Data Service so that we can better facilitate change and impact from our research and so that's why I think the scheme is really um, important and valuable. I think I've already gotten a lot from the scheme just by meeting my fellow Data Impact Fellows. In terms of the award specifically, I hope to use that to get participants from our research to get data on the ground that will enhance and complement the data that I'm already using from the UK Data Service. This fellowship is very interesting. It gives an opportunity to talk about my research to a wider audience because at the end of the day, as researchers, we want uh, our research to get outside academia and uh, have real impact in people's lives. My name is Niels Blom and I'm from City University of London. So I'm Naomi Mel and I'm from the University of Glasgow. I'm Rhiannon Williams and I'm from the University of Sheffield. I work on how violence and abuse is related to health outcomes and socioeconomic uh, outcomes. The big impact would be policy changes, so looking at um, welfare policies, housing policies, policies that are sort of yeah, shaping people's social experiences. The UK Data Impact Fellowship is really important in linking up the raw data to actual practical applications of the research we use it in, which is something that sometimes gets lost along the way. For this group, we've focused their applications on two different themes. So one being poverty, cost of living crisis and deprivation, and the other being housing and homelessness. So the hope is that it gives them opportunities to do things they wouldn't have been able to do without the money, without our support. So you can find out more on our website or on social media. We have lots of content on there from academics and those working in research roles, talking about how their research is impacting people using our data.